In order to understand the AA gradient, we need to first understand what affects the pressure of oxygen at four points. So let's break it down into the four A's. Atmosphere, airway, alveoli, artery. To work out the pressure of oxygen in our atmosphere, take the barometric pressure, 760 millimetres of mercury at sea level, and multiply that by the concentration of oxygen in air, which is 21% or 0 0.21. This means that we multiply 760 by 0 0.21. So the partial pressure of oxygen, or PO2 in the atmosphere, is 160 millimetres of mercury. Next on to the airway. As soon as this oxygen is inhaled, it will lose pressure in the airway. This is because there is water vapour, which also exerts a pressure in the airways. So now we have atmospheric pressure at sea level, Pb, which we just worked out to be 160 millimetres of mercury, minus water vapour pressure, PHTO, which is 47 millimetres of mercury, multiplied by the percentage of oxygen, 0 0.21. So now the pressure of oxygen in the airway is 150 millimetres of mercury. The levels in the alveoli, however, are further influenced by two other factors. These are both related to the presence of CO2. This is leaving the body as the O2 is entering and the relationship between the two is known as the respiratory quotient. So this amount of CO2 that leaves the body every minute, approximately 200 mils, divided by the amount of O2 which is entering the body every minute, approximately 250 mils, gives you the respiratory quotient, which is 0 0.8. We also need to take into account the pressure of CO2 in the alveoli, which is approximately 40 millimetres of mercury. This will displace some of the oxygen content in the alveoli. So now, to work out the pressure in the alveoli, we need to take all the above into account. So first, we have the atmospheric pressure of 760 millimetres of mercury minus the pressure of water vapour. Then the percentage of oxygen minus the CO2 content divided by the respiratory quotient. We then multiply this by the first part. So the pressure of oxygen in the alveoli, or the PaO2, is 100 millimetres of mercury. Note the capital A here. And then finally in the artery, if there's no lung disease, then the pressure of oxygen within the artery should also be 100 millimetres of mercury. So the P little a O2 will be 100 millimetres of mercury. So the AA gradient is a comparison of the oxygen pressure in the alveoli, big A, and the artery, small a.